Well guys, welcome back to the channel and today we're back after the pike. I have some deep lures with me. I have some shallow lures because the temperatures have dropped a lot, which means the pike are going to be feeding up for the winter. And uh, this is the real pike season in terms of the hot, hot for pike season as I say. It's, um, it's about three degrees now. It's going to warm up to about 10 today. And let's see, can we find them? But uh, come along for the ride. And as you can see, it's gonna be it's it's gonna be a tricky one finding my way here because uh, I'm on a massive river system, and it's uh, I literally can't see anything anything around me. So uh, we'll get Google Maps out or the Navionics or the Garmin chart, sorry, and uh, we'll see we can we'll see can we get there. Can't see anything around me. So this is gonna be fun. We'll uh, we'll get moving though. Only for these charts, I wouldn't have a clue where I'm going. Fish didn't realize it wasn't recording on the river roach. So there you go. Right, let's get some more. I'm just re rigging this. You'll see here now. There's little spikes on it. See the spikes there? One. It's a very shallow lure, so uh, I've actually a five ounce bit of lead around it. Let's get fishing. Now there's loads of bait fish below me, so I'm going to um, fish with a jerk bait. And my thinking is, because there's lots of fish, because there's lots of fish there, uh, they're gonna maybe pick out a, a wounded one a lot quicker. Because it'll be an easy easy catch, low expel of energy, and hopefully a meal for them. So uh, we're gonna be putting on the deviator. If I don't catch myself first. So we're gonna be putting on the deviator. Lovely red belly in it. There it is there. See the way it's shiny, so. the trout on this and I have the roach chub on the other side. So we're just going to go trolling for a while and see what we can do. Fingers crossed because uh, it's not exactly what I was hoping for. That should be loads. I don't want to put it out too much because uh, I know we're going to be hitting shallow enough ground so I'd like it to. Hopefully we don't have to wait too long but um, I'm just tidying up so if I do catch a fish I can grab the net 
and uh, get all I need pretty much without any delay. That's how you start losing fish. Right, I think it's time for a cup of tea and we will uh, we'll get some fishing done. Too shallow there and I think you're not hitting weeds or letting this hit the bottom. So I'll have to check it real quick. And then hopefully we can just help strip back out. Covering lots of fish in the fish finder there. So I really hope we can get uh, pluck something from there. Pike should be around the bait fish. But unfortunately, that's not always the case. This might be good enough fish, lads. This might be good enough fish. Give me a real run around. It's not even that good of a fish, it's just does not want to give up. Right, let's get this fella unhooked. Thank you. 